Hello everyone on behalf of Indian Institute of Food Processing Technology I welcome you all to the presentation on preparation of tomato ketchup under PM FME scheme the botanical name of tomato is Lycopersicon esculentum and it belongs to the family Solanaceae some of the famous varieties available are Pusa gaurav Arka abba Arka saurav Ratna and Rupali the shelf life of tomato is 5 days at room temperature and 10 days at refrigerated temperature. It is one of the most versatile vegetable with wide usage in Indian culinary recipes. About 789,000 hectares of area are used for tomato production and the production amounts to 19,759,000 metric tons. Among the states Andhra Pradesh, Madhya Pradesh, Karnataka, Gujarat, Orissa, West Bengal, Telangana, Maharashtra, Uttar Pradesh and Tamil Nadu grows a higher amount of tomatoes. Among the states Andhra Pradesh ranks the top. You can see here the tomato ketchup market in India. You can see the world um, comparison here against India. US produce more ketchup among all the countries and India amounts to 130 million metric tons and global tomato processing amounts to 3747 million tons this growth is credited to the fast food culture increase in the amount of working women percentage shift from homemade chutney to ketchup and the value of ketchup market in india is estimated to be around 1440 crore it is the fastest growing market and is growing at 20 percentage why tomato is so important it is nutritionally very rich in vitamin c this you can see from the total ascorbic acid content which is 27 mg per 100 g of tomatoes this is also high in fiber you can see the total fiber 1.77 g per 100 g of tomatoes you can also see a high amount of carotenoids which is around 4656 microgram per 100 g of tomato and it is also rich in a compound called lycopene in the carotenoids which is 1736 micro microgram per 100 g of tomato so lycopene is a very good antioxidant and is very beneficial on consumption so what are the facts as i said lycopene an important antioxidant compound is a potent quencher of singlet oxygen and is a major carotenoid which helps in sun protection improving the heart health and lowering the risk of cancer like colon cancer prostate cancer and it is also enriched with all other nutrients like potassium and vitamin c thus it's a very good ingredient what are all the value added products you can make from tomatoes they are ketchup sauce flakes puree paste canned tomatoes cocktails juices crushed pickles jams and soups the storage temperature of tomatoes is given here you can see for green tomato it is 55 to 60 degree fahrenheit for light red it is 50 to 55 and firm ripe it is 44 to 50 degree fahrenheit the mature grain ones can be stored at 14 degree 14 days at 55 degree fahrenheit and at a relative humidity of 90 to 95 percentage so among the value added products today we are going to see about tomato ketchup tomato ketchup is a sweet and tangy product it is made out of tomatoes sweeteners like sugar vinegar salt assorted seasoning spices and other additives in india you can see popular brands like kisan maggi kramega and del monte tomato ketchup 
Why it is used? It is a big accompaniment to a lot of fast food, side dishes and snacks. And the antioxidant compound is very popular and that is lycopene present. This is the formulation for tomato ketchup. You can see tomato juice, quantity, salt, garlic, cinnamon, cardamom, maize, glycolastic acid, sugar, onion, clove, black pepper, cumin and red chili. So this is the process flow sheet of tomato ketchup. The fully ripe red tomatoes are chosen. The washing is done after which shorting of the fruit is done. The infested and unwanted fruits are removed and some of the infested portions are also trimmed and then the good portions are used. You can either cut chop the tomatoes or you can directly go for blanching the tomatoes. Blanching is done at 70 to 90 degrees Celsius for 3 to 5 minutes. The main purpose is to inactivate enzymes. It will soften the fruit tissue. It will exclude the residual oxygen present inside the tissues and inactivate enzymes which are undesirable and which will reduce the keeping quality and the organoleptic quality of the product. After blanching, this blanching especially is done in hot water. So there are two types, steam blanching can also be done or hot water blanching can be done. So here we are going to use hot water blanching. After which pulping is done in screw type pulper. So after pulping, we have to strain the juice and strain uh, the pulp to remove the seeds and the skin and then you get the juice. This juice should be concentrated with seasonings to a TSS of 25 degree bricks. So this concentration is done by evaporation process in steam jacketed kettles. So after straining the juice, you have to now evaporate the water present in it. And meanwhile, you will also add the ingredients one by one. For example, initially sugar is added. In after sugar is being added, the pulp is cooked. And next, all the spices, after grounding them, they are all put into one bag and then they are tied. This bag is made out of muslin cloth. After tying it, it is put into the pulp, which is getting concentrated by heating. So the spices will go into the pulp by extraction method the flavor of the spices will go inside the pulp then cooking is continued by reducing the volume to about one third then the spice bag is removed after which the complete sugar is added initially one third of the sugar is added after removing the spice bag the remaining sugar is added and then you keep on cooking the pulp and how do you judge the endpoint? Using a refractometer, you can see the total soluble solid content. And that should be 25 minimum. It should not be less than 25. After achieving the endpoint, you can add the vinegar, acetic acid, salt, and preservative, which is sodium benzoate, at 750 ppm, which is 750 milligram per kg of the end product. And after this, fill, you have to fill the tomato ketchup, which is now prepared into glass bottles in hot condition at 88 degrees Celsius. And then you can crown cork them, cool them and store them for days. So you can see the pictorial representation here. Initially, after sorting, the tomatoes are washed and then they are blanched in hot water and pulped in pulper. The pulp is strained so that skin and seeds are removed and you get the juice that is now boiled in steam jacketed kettle. After which one third of sugar is added. The spice bag is added to the pulp which is being concentrated and concentration is continued by removal of water in steam jacketed kettle. Later, the remaining sugar is added 
once the amount reduces to one third and then the bricks is checked if it is above 25 the process is stopped acetic acid glacial acetic acid salt can be added and then hot filling is done after hot filling crown corking is done and then cooled labeled and packed for storage this is the fssa regulation food safety and standards authority of india regulation for tomato ketchup and tomato sauce you can see the total soluble solids salt free base should be not less than 25 percent and acidity not less than one percent this would increase the keeping quality of ketchup what we prepare next we see who are all the major players in the global market conagra brands belmonte unilever the Kraft haynes company and nestle they are the major players in the selling of tomato ketchup and thus we have immense opportunity in india to produce a lot of value added tomato products especially ketchup to conclude the changing eating habits of the population the increasing adoption to western lifestyle and culture increasing inclination towards exotic flavors of ketchup and the organic ketchup making the increasing popularity of quick service restaurants and fast food joints is giving an immense opportunity for us to value add tomatoes and to prepare tomato ketchup out of it thank you all thank you for your patience listening thank you for attending the session thank you very much